as a jeweler cherishes their gems. What a weird painting. Miko, do you know what it's supposed to show? Hmm. Probably a scene from ancient Inazuma. It's a good piece of... Hmm. Looks like the artist signed their name. Uh, let's go inside and take a look. Stabilize. This is order. Take flight. Coming to alert. Emerge. Right now. Emerge. Let's light it up. Everybody stand back. Come on out. Right here. My apologies. Embrace the ice. Emerge. Cut down. Yes. Stabilize. I will have order. This setup is quite handy. Saves me a lot of work. All right, go and take a look around. There should be a mechanism somewhere that makes the whole room move. Solidify! Ha! Show them. Right here. Emerge. You're open! Ha! Ha! Come on out! Take flight! Coming to to art! Sumetsu! Show them. <laughs> Let's light it up! Solidified.
Let me try my girl. Taste my food. Let's get down to business. Order guide you and you rise. Sakura swirl. Yeah. Let's get down to business. What's wrong with you? Take flight! Huh? Go ahead! Nothing lasts forever. Right now, right here. I swear by my sword! Whirling snow! Coming so to art! Sumetsu! Right now, right here, right now. I'm ready! I will have order! Uh. Oh, come on out. Ha. Right here. I'm ready. Quake. Cut down. Yeah. Ha. You Let's get down to business. My opponent! Let's light it up! Go as flat! Yes! Whirling snow! Sakura swirl! Everybody stand back! To the very Okay, next I will show you a secret Kitsune spell. This painting is a swift summoning medium, which means I'll be able to skip many of the more tedious steps. The murky mirror reflects the view of Inazuma in a bygone age. Spirits stirred by the sight of the past will be easily drawn to it. You're up next, little one. Come on, sit yourself down here.
Yes. The whole point of a summoning ritual is for a dead person's spirit to possess a living person's body. You saw what happened to that Oni Samurai spirit. After leaving the host's body, he was only able to maintain his form for a very short time before disappearing. Are we positive that summoning a spirit to possess the Traveler isn't going to have any lasting negative consequences? Oh, you really care about the little one quite a lot, don't you? Hmm, I'm a little jealous. I wish my friends were caring like that. <laughs> anyway, are you scared, little friend? Sit on the chair, stare at the painting, and relax your body and mind. But try and be natural. There's really no need to be nervous. Like he's sitting inside the painting. Huh? Is Paimon seeing things? Did the Recite the incantation in your heart, little one. Now, what kind of wish do we think it would take to summon forth the author of A First Hand Guide? Um, probably something to do with writing? Very good. The wish needs to be heartfelt, though, so let me help add a little... The book is selling exceptionally well, Traveler. The painting is moving again! <laughs> I never thought... What have we here? Another budding writer? What's come over... We got you! So you were the one who wrote a first-hand guide to summoning... What are you trying to do, hmm? Why'd you put that... Huh? What's this? Oh, <laughs> I see. No wonder this felt so familiar. I've walked right into your trap, haven't... You ask me what my game is here? Well, of course. It was to use this incantation as a means for all the souls of the departed yokai. What? Paimon knew it! Oh, did you now? Then how- I sense. Yeah, good. Good! With this power, no one- <laughs> Wake up! Quick! Wake up! We gotta st- <laughs> It is futile. You shall never wake him again. Hey! Come on, wake up! Don't let him take Miko! Think of something! <laughs> um, you're laughing? <laughs> You made the face enough times that I couldn't exactly miss the hint. This is what you were going for. Yeah, look what you've done to this little flying one here. <laughs> you were having plenty of fun playing the bad guy a moment ago. Urakusai? Miko, you think- Yes, we do, of course. <laughs> Allow me to formally introduce the author of A First Hand Guide to Summoning- S uh, No, wait. To be more ac- Memory? But is it- Ah, spirits, memories. They're just different words to describe the... Do you remember that recent incident when the Rift Hounds were gnawing at the sacred Sakura's roots? You witnessed human memories leaking from the ley lines, didn't you? Well, since there are human memories, of course there are going to be yokai memories, too. In life, yokai possess supernatural powers, and even when they are a shadow of their former selves from a bygone era, they still have the ability to control whether they are visible or not. Typically, yokai memories survive longer in the world than those- <laughs> Indeed, indeed. I was wandering around the sacred Sakura's roots when I suddenly heard someone yell. It piqued my curiosity, so I popped inside his body and wrote a novel for him. So that's how it happened. But why did you- in Oh, little one. Not to toot my own horn here, but when I was alive, I wasn't just another key, but with this incantation, they can go one last little joyride in the world for a couple of days. Uh, but... but... 
She's trying to say that all the commotion this causes is likely to be a great disturbance to the humans. Disturbance? <laughs> I guess you mean that we might leave them with some broken dreams after we leave, hmm? Oh, yes. But you know, I actually think that the most admirable thing about human beings is the way that they go out as for those who would rather draw on external power than seek to... So when you think about it, we're actually doing the humans... <laughs> yes. All right, then. You finally convinced Paima. What are you scared of, little one? Mm. Not only that, Irakusai, but my latest work has beaten that book you wrote, A First-Hand Guide to Summoning Spirits, to become the most popular in Inazuma. Hmm, of course. You were never one to make extra work for yourself where you can help it. And yet you went to all these lengths to find my painting room, and even took the trouble to summon me. I knew you must have some old... You were always the one to pick a quarrel with me when we all used to gather around and share stories. All right, all right. You win, I lose. Happy now? Ha! <laughs> I finally get to hear you say it centuries later. Ooh, I must say it feels good. Hmm. I remember when you were just a little girl, always... Oh, rock. Hmm. Not much. That goes for all of us, actually. We've all got to go back where we came from in the end. Everyone's quite content in many ways, but they still can't help but ask, are we ever going to have another Hyakyako? <laughs> Don't you worry about that, Urakusai. Arrangements are being made. When my bell rings, it means the moonless night is upon us. <laughs> Miko, it's been nice catching up, but I'd better conserve my energy if I want to stick it out until then. So... All right. Good. One last thing, Miko. I just want... I've been great, of course. Every day is a happy one. Especially these days. Not only do I have my light novels, but I've also met these two delightfully nosy outlanders. And even A is finally starting to come to her senses. Quite a miracle, given how pig-headed she can be. Oh, well, great. Urakusai, you'd be right at home and a great storyteller and artist like yourself would be the Yai Publishing House's ace in the hole. And I would personally be hounding you over your next installment. <laughs> he disappeared! Are you awake? How are you feeling? Are you all there? Here, like last time, repeat after me. Oh, you beat me to it. Looks like your brain is intact. So, your first possession, hmm? What was it like? <laughs> Good. Saves me from having to explain everything again. Hearing Rakusai admit defeat has put me in the most wonderful mood. Yes, though they only represent a tiny proportion of the memories in the ley lines, it will still be quite a sight to behold. Since you've come this far, why don't you do one last thing for me, hmm? I'll need you cannot be serious. <gasps> you guys teamed up to. Oh, come on. I'm really only. Paimon's paycheck? Uh, well. <laughs> <laughs>